www.theblaze.com. Scott Baker is the guy. Scott, I love The Blaze, my man. How are you? I, I'm excellent, Joe. How are you doing? I'm living the dream. Listen, I check it out every morning, every afternoon, every night. I get frequent updates. There's a blog there. People can log on. They can interact with it. What is burning up the blaze today, my friend? Uh, well, I, I'm I'm thinking of adding more stories about uh, genital groping. I think I learned a lot about that in the last hour. And, and I mean, enough way, is I enough, right? JoePags.com, and I'm pretty sure that's a picture of you groping Dennis Miller, but I don't want to get into that. <laughs> it's so, just yeah, not yeah, the I case. You, uh, we've been... Uh, uh, really uh, grateful the last 10 months on The Blaze. The, the Glenback audience has really supported us. And you actually gave us one of the best ideas we have. I used to send you like some tips in the morning before you right. fill in for Glenn. And you said, do this regularly. So now we send that out to radio hosts around the country. But right now, we have a tool on The Blaze that lets me know exactly what people are looking at at any given second. And sometimes it's what you expect, sometimes it's not. And I'll tell you, right now, the, the most popular story on The Blaze, by a factor of three, like three times more people are reading this story right now than the number two story, is the story on extreme couponing. What? It's a, it's a, it's a, there's a TV show on TLC. There's video clips in this story. There's, a, there's a, a, a pictures. It's, a, it's people that are so consumed with, like, paying nothing for their groceries that they can work <laughs> a $500 grocery bill down to, like, you know, $10. Uh, and I'm telling you, that by far is the thing that's burning up the blaze right now. All right, so it's, the, it's, the, it's not it's not Casey Anthony. It's not the TSA wanting to touch more parts of our body. It's right. not it, it's it's not the fact that there's some Chinese national making a memorial for, for Martin Luther King Jr. You're telling me it's about couponing. Well, I got to tell you, listen, I come home from work, Scott, and my, and my wife says, I wanted that Groupon thing, and I rented us a boat. Like, well, what do you mean? What do you mean you rented us a boat? Well, I got it for one, for one quarter of the price, but we didn't need a boat. So yeah, no, I, I'm with you. I mean, this is like it's like a way of life now. It is. I, th I think they get addicted to it. So, sir, one story we have surging though right now is a story. Um, you know, we look for stories that are on 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 good sites, good blogs, and we noticed a good story on uh, the Weasel Zippers blog, and Michael Palka wrote it up on this UN expert who, on his blog, publishes this really nasty anti-Semitic cartoon. And uh, you can look at the cartoon. It's in the, in the story. Oh, I yeah. think that if you look at that story, you'll say, well, it would jump out at you what's wrong with this story. This guy then said, oh, I didn't realize it was anti-Semitic. I'm so sorry. But the guy's also a truther. And, and, and I'm, I'm looking at this thinking, why are you a UN expert on Palestinian, uh, you know, issues? How did you even get into that that list? I can't, I can't follow it. And nobody, nobody's, nobody's putting a death threat on him because he didn't, he didn't put like a bomb fuse inside of Muhammad's turban. Exactly. So I, exactly. The, the big difference there, Scott. I love you like a brother, my man. Let's do this again tomorrow, okay? All right, thanks. Thanks, Scott Baker, The Blaze. Make sure you stop by. Go check it out.